Good morning guys and welcome back. So today we're going over the five things that I hate about my 2010 Jeep JK Unlimited. Now, hate is a very strong word. These are mostly dislikes of things that could probably easily be changed, but it's probably the fact going from a TJ that's a little bit more basic than going to something that's controlled by electronics. But before we get started on the five things I hate about my Jeep JK, comment below about the things you don't like or dislike. It doesn't have to be hate, just the five things you dislike about your Jeep or four wheel drive. Now, the five things, it's not really five things, I couldn't come up with five because I absolutely loved this Jeep. It is, it is amazing, before we get started, it is amazing, I absolutely love it. It's not really five things, it's more like two or three things and they're kind of the same thing or based around the same thing. So before people start hating on me in the comments, I don't hate my Jeep, there's just a few things I kind of dislike about it um, and a few things I need to get on and change. So the first thing I hate about my Jeep JK is the electric accelerators that are on the JK. Coming from a TJ that's got a cable accelerator, as soon as you touch the accelerator, you got full throttle and it's perfect. You can feel the difference, well you can feel when you're giving it gas and not giving it gas, you can feel the car actually revving and moving. With the JK, because it's electric, there's a slight delay between you putting your foot down and the computer actually realizing uh, that the that you're actually giving it any sort of throttle. So there's a small delay, so you're trying to feather the clutch and feather accelerate at the same time to try and take off smoothly. So I'm not the best driver in the world. I'm, I'm an okay driver, I'm an okay manual driver. I've been driving manual cars for like the last 12 years. And I'm not bad, I can take off, I can do hill starts, everything like that. But in the JK, I've stored probably um, 50 or 60 times in the last six or seven months that I've owned it. Now. And if you've got an automatic JK, that probably wouldn't be as noticeable because you don't have that, you can just put your foot down, you don't have to worry about trying to feather the clutch at the same time as the accelerator. That is the biggest pet peeve and it's absolutely a pain in the ass when you're trying to take off on hills, when you're just trying to take off in general, and when you're forward driving as well. It absolutely sucks. If you guys know any solutions to this, so do I need to change my clutch, do I need to change my driving style, I don't know what it is, but if you guys do know or you guys got any ideas, let me know in the comments down below. So, moving on uh, with the second thing I hate about my Jeep JK is, if you've ever driven a JK before, if you press the brake pedal down all the way, the brakes will actually lock in. It's like a, I wouldn't call it a hill descent, but like a anti-rollback feature. It'll be fine if I want it to roll back, but when I don't want to roll back and I've actually pushed the accelerator, the accelerator, the breakdown too far, that actually will lock in. So back again to trying to take off, I'm trying to take off and the brakes engage. There's a small delay about probably three to four seconds before the car actually realizes you're trying to go forward um, and then it disengages that brake for you to actually go. Now it's fine if you're on a hill, then you can kind of like feather it and play with it, um, but it's absolutely annoying. The amount of times I've pressed on my brake, my brake um, at a set of lights, and not realize that it's actually been engaged and trying to take off and stored. It's fucking, it's so bloody annoying. Maybe there's a way to disengage it, I don't know. But those two things, I want, oh, those things, I don't know if it's just a JK or it's like, I'm not used to it coming from like a more simpler sort of Jeep. Uh, with the, whether I'm not used to all this fancy dancing stuff with the JK, because I'm used to TJs and much slimper cars, uh, where you've got cable accelerators and not anti-braking and uh, all that sort of stuff. But it's very annoying for my type of driving. And I think it'd be more annoying because you've got a manual rather than an automatic. An automatic might not be so bad, but in a manual it's a very frustrating. So those are only really the two things I absolutely hate about my Jeep. Other than those two things, so it wasn't really five, it was more like two, to be fair. Other than those two things, with the accelerator and the braking because they're both electric and it just annoys me. Um, other than that, they are fantastic. I've got no other issues with my Jeep whatsoever. I absolutely love it. But those two things are very, very annoying. They absolutely do my head in, especially the accelerator. I did have that high kit throttle controller, but it's mostly for acceleration after you're off the line, not taking off the line itself. That's really annoying, guys. But if you guys any got but if you guys got any solutions for me, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, let me know in the comments below what 
Let me know in the comments below what you guys don't like about your vehicles, whether it's a Jeep or just a general four-wheel drive. Other than that, that's pretty much it for today, guys. If you like this video, smash the like button, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys next time.